Okay, hello, hello, it's Robin, and I am going to do session number one with the Neat Cell Picosecond Blue Light Laser Pen on my Pearl Jam Tattoo. Um, this morning I did session two of this tattoo, session one of this tattoo, and a little on my face right here. And um, this one still burns pretty bad, but what I noticed is that there's more fading um, than even like after, after, right after I finished doing the tattoo, this one is fading even more. Some of the lines are fading even more. So it's definitely working. Um, so that's good news, right? That's, I mean, that's why I'm, that's what I wanted to know. So, um, so yeah, slowly we're getting rid of the tattoos, but it does burn pretty bad. What I'm going to do it, when I do session two of this tattoo, which actually, now that I'm looking at it, I see more fading again. I see more fading than when I finished doing the tattoo. Definitely. Whoa. And I only just noticed that. You are witness. Cool. So so they're working. It's working. The sessions is why, why I said they. Um, so it's working. Cool. Okay. So we're getting rid of tattoos. This is what we're doing. We're going to get rid of... We're going to do the PJ tattoo, which... I gotta say, that's my favorite tattoo, but I would like to get rid of all of them. I'm just kind of sick of having tattoos. Okay? Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, she's gonna be, she, this one's gonna be worked on. My son was just making fun of me because everything's a she. Because why is everything a she? So, we plugged it in, a neat cell pen. She's upside down. See how everything's a she. I'm going to put it on the highest intensity and the highest frequency, which is number one. This blue light pen goes one to nine, and number one is the highest of, of in, intensity or whatever. Okay, so here's the tattoo before. Let's pull it up close. Here's the before of this tattoo. Very windy outside if you hear some weird noises. That's what that is. It's a tarp on the roof blowing around. Or just the wind. That's the tarp. Yeah. Came loose again. I might have to get back on the roof. Okay. So anyway, let's uh <laughs> um one thing is that I don't know how many uses I've done so far, but you saw it just now. It's this power button's getting kind of um, stuck a little bit, so that is happening. But I paid nine ninety nine nine dollars ninety nine cents for the warranty of this thing. I think it's a lifetime warranty, and so if I need to replace it or get it fixed or whatever, 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 um, I will do so with through the company I will contact the company and let them know hey the power button is getting uh, stuck or whatever okay I think I'm gonna have to go on the roof again actually pause this okay so yes went on the roof hopefully I fixed the problem but it's very windy outside so it's coming in that what sucks is now there's a little bit of rain drops Coming from the air too, and that's obviously the whole point of why the tarp is on the roof is to to help that. So, whatever. If it happens, it happens. Let's plug this in, which starts the machine. We'll turn it up to. Excuse me. We'll put it to one and highest there. I'm letting it ramp up a little bit before I start my thing. I just washed my hands. I don't think I really need to go over 
this again like to wash it or anything I'm let me I'm letting this machine ramp up a little bit it has like a sound like an escalation ramping it up as what I'm calling it so we're letting that happen after I'm done I'll put the A and D ointment on it which is why this went so shiny but um, yeah, anyway, if I didn't finish what I was saying about this one, I, uh, which I don't think I did, I because I got distracted that I do see more fading than I did before, um, is that I'm going to wait to do that one because this one stung a lot. And you're supposed to wait weeks before you do it again and I had only waited days because I'm a very impatient person so we're gonna push the power button we're gonna do this tattoo and get you a little bit closer there you go and um, then we'll get it done and get you closer and I'm gonna put this mirror right here to help me to see better are we good we're good okay so ow <laughs> it stings more today than it did before. Darn it. Let's start at the foot. Ow. Ow. Okay, let's ow. <laughs> let's not do the Let's put keep the intensity at the highest and then turn the frequency hertz to number 9, intensity high. This at number nine. I don't know what that'll change. Let's see what that does. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, it's better. Ow! Mmm! Okay, let's turn the intensity down. Still stings. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> it stings pretty good. It's nice to know that I do see results. Ow! So it's like, ah, and it looks like, <laughs> it looks like a healthy results, you know what I mean? They're not, it's not bubbling up or weird. It's not scarring weird, but I mean, keep watching. We're both still finding out what this stuff, what this thing does. Ow! It would be nice actually to have like a little fan blowing on it because I notice naturally I just keep wanting to blow on it and it feels better when you blow on it. So if I had, I might grab my little fan. I don't think I have it here. Ah! Ah! Mmm. Okay, so yeah, session one with these, with this tattoo. Notice how I'm going over each spot a few times. That's what I did with the other tattoos as well. It'll take several sessions. And I, I will, ow, I will wait weeks. In between each session for to um, yeah since the skin is getting 
burnt and damaged or whatever you want to call it since the skin is yeah Ooh. <sighs> um so i will wait weeks in between so let it heal properly and thoroughly before doing the next session even if i feel that you know it wasn't affected as much Ow. Closer you get, the more it stinks. For short. <laughs> so it really depends on how the intensity, you know, everything, it all matters. Like how, how far you have it from your skin matters, how long you keep it on each little section matters. As far as pain goes. But you're in full control, as you can see. And I honestly would much rather do this on myself than have another person doing it for me. That's just me, though. Is somebody else, they're not going to know Ow! what you're feeling, you know. Like me, the second I go, ow, you notice I stop doing it. Ooh, okay. Let's go over it a little more. Ow, ow, ow. It's just me trying to like talk myself into it. Ooh. Ow! Okay. Ow. Ow. Get his little goatee. <laughs> Some of these tattoos that I have, somebody else is going is going to have to do it for me. On my back, I'm not going to be able to do those myself. I might be able to do the corn one. Ow! The one you keep seeing on my back shoulder. But I definitely won't be able to do the one on the center top of my back right here. Mm, not myself, no. I think I'm going to stop. My hand is getting like uncoordinated for some reason, as well as I don't want to go over it too many times. I just, I don't want it to burn the skin. I think I'm doing a pretty good job at not burning the skin though. Saw it here, folks. Um, yeah, I'm going to go over it just a little bit more. Whew. So, yeah, I'm, I'm liking this less intensity. Oh! It's working. It's tolerable, as you can see. Trying to avoid looking right at it, especially like right now. I just had to look through like the bottom of my glasses. I'm kind of get really flat. It's very, very bright. Oh. 
I would suggest definitely wear protective eye gear because it stings your eyes. Let's be done with this, okay? Okay. All right, session one. Complete. The PJ tattoo. Goodness. Does he have some streaks in his hair now? It sure looks like it. Um, so yeah, I'll have to really look at the before and after. Pretty good, but I kinda I do see a little bit of fadage in certain little parts. And judging by the other tattoos, I know that it's and it is that it is that <laughs> that it is working for tattoo fadage. So stay tuned for the next one, folks. Does it hurt? Yes, as you can see. So thank you. Yeah, thank you for watching. I hope that you, I hope you got something for this. If you're, you know, doing your own research to see if if you want to do, I imagine that's the only reason that you'd be watching this. Um. Yeah, to see if you want to use the pen. So that's what I did. I watched videos for research before. So, um, yeah, I'm only getting started. And so I don't know how many sessions it'll take, but we're going to find that out. You know, I'll find that out as time passes. Whew. It's not too bad. It just... And if you got the tattoo in the first place, you, you, have, you have a pretty good pain threshold anyway to like chill out you can do it you can do it if i can do it you can do it anyway i'll stop taking up your time peace out take care much love bye bye bye, -bye.